Go, my rats! <laughs> now you are the rats king! <laughs> Hey there, Borkos. Welcome back to Borkia Games. I'm Steven. And I'm Will. With a new microphone. Mmm, <laughs> yeah. This is our own Black King. Who's packing heat? And today we're playing Shotgun King. A chest-based tale of last resort where you get to stuff shotgun shells with live rats and hurl full-sized horses at wounded enemy soldiers, which then explode into rats. Chess. Anyway, let's get to it. Uh, we've played this a bit before, not a whole ton. We have all the guns unlocked, I believe. The Solomon, the Victoria, the Ramses the Second, Richard the Third, and that one is really cool. The melee one. Try the Victoria. All right, we'll go. We'll go for the Victoria. Let's go for firepower. We want to be able to kill those queens in one hit when they get even near us. Yeah. All right, we have a strategy. Lock and load and go on in. <laughs> Black King had been an extravagant and unpleasant ruler. As the years went by, more and more of his subjects were won over by the White King, who offered higher wages and genuinely decent work. And then I took his castle. His knights resigned from his service. Even his wife, the Queen, abandoned him. Before leaving the blast, Black Bishop came to the Black King and told him, Thou hast been a bad king, yet thine reign is still holy. Thou shalt retain a claim over thine former subject's souls, and we may yet have cause to fear thine wrath. Thus, heed my warning, the wrath of a man, as godly as might thee be, is ever his undoing. And the Black King, abandoned by all, not all collect to his name, all he had left was his prized royal shotgun, the shreds of his dignity, and the growing fires of the prophesied wrath. Ever my undoing, was it? Undone! Just what more exactly could I lose? In his dark folly, the king loaded the shotgun and went to meet his final checkmate. All right. So, Shotgun King. how this game works, it is chess, but obviously there's not a full white army and you're just the black king with your shotgun. Um, you can move one space at a time and each enemy unit has a timer. Every turn that you take depletes that timer. You also have an additional visual indicator, like ones that will move will be shaking. And each piece has an invisible threat range. See those red squares? That's where you can't step or be at the end of your turn. But we should uh, be able to decimate pretty much everything with one shot, so. Yeah. Also, when you kill a, uh, a special unit, <laughs> it allows you to move like that unit for one turn. Murdered the king. Yeah. All right, easy enough. Two choices, you have to take an advantage and a disadvantage. They are paired together. Mm -hmm. So we got elite gem, plus one ammo regeneration and fire range. And then king can't be killed if a knight is alive. Knight HP plus one. That's kind of neat. <laughs> that is kind of neat. The ammo regeneration might really help us out with a Victoria because we have such low ammo. Oh, <laughs> taunting hop. Once per turn, you can jump over a nearby piece for one damage without ending the turn. That's thing neat. Saboteur, move, remove two pawns, add one bishop, double the fire arc for one bullet. Yeah, no, 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 no. Let's get the regeneration one and have to kill the knights. That sounds really fun, actually. I think the regeneration will really help with this gun. Because <laughs> mm -hmm. while I do only have four shots to start with, every time you move, like, periodically you will get more ammo just from moving around. Yeah. The key is eventually that becomes very tricky to survive because you, you know, you're, you're moving. Move up to the right, then bishop up straight up behind that knight that's about to move up there, and then kill the king. Uh, I can't move there because I would die. All right, move up one up to the left first, then. Yeah, that's fine. Then if I yeah, move now here, move up there. And assassinate that. Well, king can't be killed if a knight is alive. We have to kill the knight. Oh, all right. Sorry, yeah. I forgot about that. No, it's all good. Yeah, we gotta go up. There we go. And then we are safe. Yes. To shoot. And then we'll move over here. Take that bishop. Move over here, and we're we're basically golden. Uh, Let's click on the gun. So 
You can either click on the gun at the top to reload, or every time you move, you will reload. But reloading by clicking is choosing to pass the turn, basically, for movement. All right, blunderbuss, fire arc plus 30. No, we don't want that. No, we do not. We, we have high firepower, but we want accuracy with this mm -hmm. thing. Remove one bishop, add two knights. We definitely don't want that. <laughs> no. Play an extra turn when you kill a knight. Oh. Ooh. Fire arc minus 10%. Degrees. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Add one pawn. The secret heir replaces the king if he dies. This is going to be boss. Oh. oh, yeah. Let's do that. Let's do this that. This is going to be amazing. <laughs> <laughs> this game is so freaking fun. It chasing pieces all over the board. This is going to be fun <laughs> as hell. Hiding heir. Okay, so that's just a nice reminder that if we kill the king and there are pawns alive, one of them is designated as the secret heir at the beginning of the game. If you kill the pawn before the king dies, then it doesn't matter. So knight dies first. Yes. Just fire into that line of pawns from down here and wait for that bishop to come to you. Uh, I'll just shoot the bishop. Or just shoot him. Yeah, why not? Yeah, why not? At this point, I might as well take some steps. I got two bullets for that. That's that's gonna be real handy. Mm -hmm. I want to take care of all these pawns first because it's easy right now mm -hmm. at this stage. Yeah. And uh, I don't want to have to just waste my time with another. Game. All right. <sighs> so floor three, you kind of have like disadvantages that are set at particular floors. Yes. Uh, we now will have a queen on the board. This is the same every time you play through. Ravenous rats. When you kill a piece, a rat bites the nearest target for one damage. Oh my god, that's amazing. Mm. <laughs> and then royal loafers. Strafe mode. Right click a target and fire on your next move. That's pretty cool. Hmm. But the rats, the rats though. The rats are cool. The rats are cool. Get the rats. It is only one damage. Though. Rat, 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 rat. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. I'll get the first rats. <laughs> Calm down. Rat. Rats. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. Oh, the, yeah, the rats. The rats got that queen. Hell yeah. Yeah, blast a random one up in there. Yeah, the rats are a good <laughs> choice. Kill that queen Reload before here. you go anywhere, though. Yeah. Oh, look at that rat go. <laughs> oh, the nearest piece, not adjacent pieces. Yeah. That's yeah. way better than I thought. Go, my rats. <laughs> now you are the rat king. <laughs> oh, my God. Yep. All right. What do we got? Wand of Wrath. Deal firepower damage to a non-king target. That would be fun. Military Academy, add one knight every 10 turns. You Wand of Wings, move up to three squares in any directions. That, ooh. All pieces minus one speed, but plus one HP. And we don't have a blade, but it would reduce our blade damage. I think that's a better deal. We can deal with one extra HP. Yeah. Yeah, it'll be a nice benefit. Short range teleport for three squares is very, very good. Yeah. And just reload. We'll see, we'll see about the air, the air situation here, because I'm just going to kill this king. There we go. Yay! Now, I'm curious. I don't think... It'll do it again? Yeah. I don't think it randomly chooses one, it's just... No. Yeah, the very beginning of the turn. Yeah. Minus one additional shell in your shotgun, plus seven arc. We don't want more arc, not with this thing. Move one bishop and no. Add two we have to kill the knights before the king, so deal firepower damage. <laughs> I guess we're getting the wand. We get the other wand and add one queen. Queen moves are limited to three squares. Oh my god! Oh dang, that's excellent, actually. Yeah, that's incredible. That's double blessings. Excellent. So we just open it up with a strike yeah, on we well take one of the queens the, uh, or something, or the, on the knight actually. Knight. Uh, I'm gonna step over here. Oh, what? Oh, you can tell who the heir is? That's wild. How do I know? Don't matter, I guess. Interesting. There you go. There you go! So, the queen... Oh, only three spaces, it's so good! That's so good. Oh, man, that's just that's so, so good. That's so nice. Oh. Whew. All right, so let's, uh, let's take care of these pawns. And this bishop here. 
Go, my rat. Kill your king. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Onward we go. Cornered. Desperate. Oh. Plus two firepower flip card if you're king. On the board's edge. It's not on the board's. Okay. That's, I mean, that's easy firepower for us, but what is this? Remove one pod, add one knight. Minus one max ammo. Oh, the max ammo hurts. For this gun, yeah. We can't do this, though, because I'm not having two queens that can't die. No. No way. It's okay. We'll, we'll be okay. It gives us no incentive to store ammo, though, which is nice. Yeah. Pick out the bishop, actually, because it's the only one that can actually cross the board in one turn. Smart. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, we're gonna move. Yeah, that's safe. Ish. It is safe. You'll be able to queen out if you need to. Alright, there we go. Oh yeah, and you get extra turns for killing knights. <laughs> uh, so good. We forgot about that part, huh? A little bit, a little bit. It's easy to forget. There's a lot going on. Mm-hmm. Uh, so knights are actually sort right. of a benefit to us in a way. In the heck out of there. High focus, plus one firepower, Ooh, minus one maybe. arc. That's very good. Add two knights, one bishop, one rook, all speed, minus one. Oh my god. That is really interesting. Uh, blunderbuss. We don't want blunderbuss. Remove one no. pawn, add one bishop. We don't want any more. No. No. We can't have less max ammo. No, not even less. So we gotta yeah. go with a... Uh, this will be fun. A much more full board. Things are gonna get dicey. Yes, but we have a lot of firepower when we're on the edge of the board and there's nothing next to us. Okay, uh, is there still just one bishop? There's two, but we'll, we'll use this to take care of one we of them. We just added a rook and a bishop, didn't we? Oh. Oh, yeah. We'll, we'll save it. We'll save it for if we need it. Right. Because that could be... That could save us. That could come in clutch, indeed. You could use the queen's soul to get up there real fast. Oh my god, you super don't need to. Look at that. <laughs> okay, I gotta start being pretty careful here, though, because... You got an extra turn whenever you kill a knight, don't forget. Oh my god, and the rats. There's a queen. We gotta step to the side here. That's another queen. Uh, use your queen card to get to the right side of the screen. They can only move three spaces. If I step here, it should be okay. Oh, uh, yeah! So let's take care of this queen. Oh my god. I love the rats so much. <laughs> and we need to... Kill a knight and get an extra turn. Yes. Very smart. We can't step here. Reload. Yeah, reload. Kill the queen. <laughs> reload. reload. Kill, Kill the knight. knight. Get an extra turn. And then we will need to... I don't want to get cornered, so let's go up. Oh, double rats! Yeah! <laughs> Alright, let's uh, let's just try to kill the king. Hey, we got the air. Yeah, good, dude. Good, good. Alright, what do we got here? King's shoulders, once per floor, drag a nearby piece on your king and throw it in any direction. What? Add two pawns and one rook, and then reduce rook HP by two. And then we got blade. Nah. Plus one blade, minus one firepower, king HP minus two. Interesting. Terrible. Uh, but then add one pawn every five. Oh god, no. Uh, I don't want more rooks, but at least they'll be easier to kill. I don't know what this is. King's shoulders? Nearby piece on your king. Oh, it's the king's castle. <laughs> That's hilarious, and it's just him throwing people around. That's amazing. <laughs> oh, goodness. Oh, that's a lot of pieces. Don't forget that you're more powerful at this space than you are yeah. not on the edge. So, like, yeah, yeah. Waging your war from down here is a really good idea, actually. Just drilling straight to the king. Maybe you can even... Yeah. Okay, uh... This queen's got three more turns. It's saving us from this... Well, this rook's gonna go... I say fire so. into that bishop. Yeah, let's let's deal with that. 
Move over here. And over here. Oh gosh. We'll be okay. We'll be okay. Just watch. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's incredible. It's, the rats uh, are so good. Dude. The rats are oh so my god. good. <laughs> the rats are really good. Next oh, turn. also you can throw pieces. I forgot about that. Oh yeah, let's test that out with a pawn. Let's let's try to let's, yeah. let's not forget about this rook. In fact, let's just kill this rook. There you go. And then uh, we'll come over here. So I think, I think we just, yeah, we can. <laughs> we get a little claw. Oh my gosh. We carry it around, and we can throw it. <laughs> Holy sh! And it does damage. That's so cool. Oh my god. That's the best. Can you do that to knights and stuff too? Any non-king piece, I think it said. <laughs> Okay. One cannonball. Mm, no, we can't ammo max down. No, absolutely not. Uh, Non-king pieces can't come near your king. That's really cool that you get a threat range. Okay. Yeah. Uh, remove two pawns, add one bishop. Oh, come on. Doubles fire arc for one bill. Oh my god. That's terrible. We can't take that. We can't take that, but also we can't minus one hit max ammo. Add one cannonball to the chessboard. Cannonballs can be grabbed and thrown at pieces. Oh, actually, no, no, that sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 I was going to say, A, we have to take it, and B, it doesn't sound that bad. No, 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 cannonball on the board sounds pretty good. There it is. <laughs> mm -hmm. So can I, uh, I'll step over here and then I can grab this. <laughs> yeah, throw it at them. <laughs> Oh my god, that's so few shots. Oh my god. <sighs> you can kill that with one shot. It won't let me. Take a step forward. Up one. Crap. Over here. God. You are checkmated, sir. Oh, hold on. Oh yeah. And then I got an extra turn, so... Oh, I can pick it up and throw it. Oh yeah, pick him up. Throw him at the other one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this game is incredible. Reload and kill that queen. <sighs> Kill these guys, because they might be the air. Mm hmm You never know. <laughs> oh man, that's so good. Alright. Undercover mission. When you reach uh, the waypoint, wait, wait, wait. choose a disruption effect and play an extra turn. Plus four rook HP. No, oh god. I don't, I don't, I don't know about that. Injured pieces lose to speed. Oh, yes. slows down white and black backup cards by 50%. Oh. Pawn speed plus one, bishop speed plus one, flip cards if there's no bishop on the board. I say the bottom choice. Yeah. Caltrops Injured and pieces loot to speed is incredible with the rats. Oh, hey, buddy. What you doing? <laughs> oh my god, and then you got an extra turn for it. <laughs> oh my god, it's dizzy. That's so good. That's very, very good. Yeah, with the rats, this build is like... The rats mm. really, really help. They really f***ing help. Alright, so the only thing... This rook can go over here. This rook can basically go here or here. And that's it. So we're safe right. for now. Mm -hmm. Yeah! Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't 
forget you have extra damage on the edge of the board. Yes, which I cannot be on right now. <laughs> oh, dear God. Alright, then we can step over here, shoot the rook. And we come over here, grab the cannonball, chuck it at the king. And he's dead. Yeah. <laughs> so many years worth of new subjects. So much work to make them feel welcome and safe. All reduced to glass shards by one royal f with a shotgun. The White King would not indulge this. Not one more floor, quite literally bursting with rage, he loomed out to crush his egotist. This egotistical maniac. Yeah, I was gonna say it right. This egotistical maniac. Fix it in post. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <sighs> He's a biggie boy. Mm. Takes up four spaces. Moves just like a king, but a big. And has a lot of health. And I imagine he probably can't be killed if there are knights alive because of our thing, our, uh, our card so, thing we got. let's start killing. You trapped the bishop and the rook together. That's great, that's beautiful. They literally can't leave. All right, we have two rooks that are free, which could be a big problem for us. We also have this one, so we'll do that if we get into some serious trouble. Shoot that knight from here. Um, I can't right now. I need ammo. Yeah, baby! Oh, look at that! Oh, those rats! Didn't stand a chance. Woo. This is the air. That would be bad. That would be very bad if the <laughs> boss very, resurrected itself. Bad. Yeah. And then, uh, and then you are trapped. Yeah. Did I have to screw myself. I think I have to screw myself. And then you'll be able to assassinate the rook. Both rooks. Okay. We're doing great now. And then assassinate the queen with the wand, please. Now I'm gonna take a step. Don't worry. Oh, thank God. Dead. Dead. Not a problem. Just dead. Just want to be extra careful. Hmm. Ah, there we go. Hell yeah. <laughs> We've been dead it. And so it was that the wrath of the Black King finally carried him to victory. His turn to steal the White King's castles and subjects. They would have to endure his terrible rule once again. Cheer up! They would tell me. At least thou didn't get blown to pieces. As he upheld his shotgun and laughed, undefeated, he had learned nothing. It wouldn't be too long before a new White King rises up and the whole story starts. It's the Black King ecosystem. There we go. Isn't nature beautiful, <laughs> Stephen? <laughs> all right, Borkos, that's all the time we have for now. Big thanks to our Borko bishops for their support. If you want to see more turn-based strategy based on antiquated European recreational activities, check this video out. If you enjoyed this video, let us know if you're the secret heir in the comments below. And of course, if you'd like to help us get some live traps, rats are starting to become a problem. See the description for details. It's a lot of rats. So many. It's way too many. Goodbye forever. Until next time.